Hey guys, this is OMG Daily. Titi and Ya for you guys. We yeah. have some interesting stories for you guys. Mm -hmm. And we're starting off with the visa lottery. Okay. Mm -hmm. What's happening there? So now, uh, it's going to be a lot more difficult for Ghanaians to travel to the US okay. uh, because they're trying to now abolish the whole visa lottery thing that they do every year for Ghanaians. Mm -hmm. uh, so now um, you won't have the chance or win the chance to go. And even, you know, there were some restrictions when winning too, because if you didn't fit specific requirements, uh, then you weren't going to the U.S. <laughs> Why were you planning on going? Yes. Oh, oh. My uncle is there. I want to go and visit him. Oh, oh. You see, now even with that, before a lot of people they would use their family yeah. um, to have them bring them over, but now that's that's not acceptable so, anymore. So we do. How can we go there? Hmm. It's going to be very interesting. A very tough process. Yes, we go U.S. Be man. Train, train, train. Yeah. <laughs> US no ye betu miako, but a bear dinya na say si anye ma ye kwa ma ye mbakra. Oh, they'll let you come, but it'll be very difficult. Yes, very difficult. Yo. So if you're not earning a certain amount, if you can't pay for your own health care, um, just different things, depending on your profession and things like that, they yeah. just won't allow you to just come. Because they want to give the Americans in mm -hmm. America more of an opportunity to shine in the country, you know? No, but say you call nice ye juma. We pay taxes though. Mm -hmm. We pay taxes. Mm -hmm. So yes. how about that? Yes. And let's say you're one more, it's free. We yes. pay our taxes. We pay our taxes, but they don't care. They want more Americans to do <laughs> American jobs and things like that. They yeah, want them to shine. I don't know you. You see, America now. You say you're America, America, America. Yaka. Yes. Yes. So, America. Yes. So you say you say Afghanistan, say Dubai. Hey, Afghanistan or Dubai? Hey. Oh, but you know, Dubai would be nice. I think Dubai would be cool. I haven't gone before, but I've heard no, it's But nice. America is America. Yeah, true. I don't know why people see it as heaven, but you know, it's fine. <laughs> what next story do we have? Yes, Uber. Uber. Oh, okay. Uber in Ghana is already some way. But now we have an Uber driver who is sending threats. He sent a threat to a passenger he was supposed to pick up. Oh. Yes. So apparently, you know, he arrived at the, the destination. Okay. And the woman, I guess, you know, she wasted his time. Okay. So he got upset and he said, you, I'll deal with you. Three days time, you'll see what hap will happen to you. Message, text message. Like he sent her a text message saying that. And can you imagine just receiving a message from someone, like just yeah. sending a threat like that? Like what would you do? Three days. Yes, three days time. Money, three days. Yes, I'll but deal with you. What's going to happen to her? Hey, something spiritual. <laughs> spiritual? Yes. So Uber. Mm. They are employing juju people. Yes, yes, apparently so. You know, some of these people, they don't think. They don't think before they act. So now this man, he's been suspended from the app. He can't access it to, okay. to work or anything okay. like that, which I think is cool. Yes, it's cool. I him. think he should be blocked permanently. Like, he shouldn't be allowed back. But it's crazy. But what would you do if you were the lady? Then? Yeah, I'll go to church <laughs> and I'll pray. I'll be like, Pastor, please. I don't know what I did. I know maybe my makeup took too long. <laughs> so please, <laughs> beg for me. Ask God, please. Wow. To cancel this. Yes. It's serious. I'll be scared today. Me too. I'll be scared. But, you know, it's as well. But I hope the management will take this thing. Oh, definitely. Very, very yes. The, I mean, we yeah. don't want to be threatened over this. I mean, yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Hmm. We'll see. We'll oh, what's see. Our next story? Next story. Mm -hmm. Shata Wale. Yeah. Champion. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So apparently, this man, uh, you know, he's he, he's not married. You know, I know oh, we Wait, are. wait, wait, wait. Hmm. Shata is married. Hey, he's not married, please. The traditional marriage was nothing. That was just, I guess, formality or whatever. No, I don't but know. Ghana for. Yes. As Ghanaians, the traditional mm -hmm. marriage, you know, any marriage. Means marriage. Yes. But apparently, he's not married. Apparently, so. You okay, know. so what So he, he said now? when he gets old, so maybe 50s, 60s, around there, that's when he'll be ready to get married. So, and he's saying this because he feels like, oh, he'll be done fooling. His wife too, she'll be old enough, so you know, she won't want to go clubbing and pop and oh, do all those things. No, same thing for me though. I feel the same way. Like me, I'll chill. I'll chill until my time on earth is up. Yeah. yeah so you know, it's, it's so they're not the married. Story. So they're not married. He said. When they said we hold my movie moon. Oh, so you want to marry him? Oh, say also say I do not survive the men. Shut up. So shut up. She's here for you. 
<laughs> but yeah, so we'll see what happens. We'll yeah, see. Yeah, we can see. Yeah. So that's all we have for you guys. Uh, we'll see you guys another time. Bye. Bye.